Hi, here I am Dr. Zell and the topic is Enchondroma. Enchondroma, these are benign bone tumors that begin in the cartilage found inside the medullary cavity of tibular bones. Enchondromas are the most common type of hand and foot tumor, although they can develop in body lung bones. Most often they are solitary. However, multiple tumors can appear as a part of the condition such as Ollier's disease and Mafusi syndrome. Single enchondromas rarely become cancerous. Enchondromas comprise stables of a mature hyaline cartilage, partially or completely, and surrounded by normal bone. Cartilaginous tubules may undergo endochondral ossification and often resulting in the characteristic rings and arcs pattern of mineralization. Enchondromas are commoner in middle aged patients. In most cases, enchondromas are painless, so don't require any treatment. If the tumors are multiple, can weaken and deformed and can lead to the pathological bone fracture. And pathological fractures are commonly treated by carotage and bone grafting. Enchondromas can be diagnosed on radiological features. Having variable appearances, although typically they are smaller than 5 cm, intramedullary light clearance and with non-aggressive features such as narrow zone of transition, sharply defined margins, chondroid calcifications in the form of rings and arcs. Often they are purely lytic and no mineralization and may present with expansile and may have endosteel scalloping. In this radiograph here you can see there is an solitary expansile lytic lien of the fifth metacarpal containing amorphous matrix calcification. There are characteristics of enchondromas and there is no pathological fracture. In this radiograph, here you can see many of the bones of the hand with listened expansions and sharp zones of transition and non-aggressive appearance few having the central calcification that suggestive of Ollier's disease. In this photo here you can see the left hand has increased soft tissues while in this radiograph here you can see multiple expansile intramedullary lesion lesions involving the multiple phalanges bones with multiple rounded soft tissue densities seen around the first, second and fifth finger associated small tiny calcifications representing phyllobolith related to soft tissue hemangiomas. Overall findings are suggestive of Mafusi syndrome. Please subscribe my channel for more videos and updates. Yeah.